Hi Unity folks, this is Tim Grotman, and this is a bug report. This time it's specific to the input.get joystick names. My examples have a Wii example common, where I just have a update joysticks method that is based on a timer that updates the uh, joystick names every three seconds or whatever, so that I don't kill the performance trying to get the joystick names. Uh, anyways, the issue is we'll take a look at one of my examples here. Let's say the uh, use show unity input scene. Okay. And if I switch over to the Wii, I'm going to turn on some of the controllers here. Okay. Now all three controllers are turned on. There's an LED light on each controller, just like the Wii and the Xbox 360 controller that indicates what controller index is available. Now in our case, I can get that number from the Java side through the Wii SDK. Um, but I don't have a way to correlate that number to these controllers because they all say I'll have the same name, the game controller. So what I need is some way to correlate the device ID to these these guys so that I can correlate it to the LED number. Okay, so that's part of it. The other issue is if I find controller number one. Okay, so here's controller number one. If I just tap the touch trackpad, the focus will go to controller 2. Okay, which is this guy. Alright, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to pull the battery out of the first controller. So we know input get joysticks names is going to return controller 1, controller 2, and controller 3. Pulling the controller battery is going to drop it from the Bluetooth stack, and eventually, I don't know, maybe after a few seconds or minutes or whatever, it eventually, like, you know that I disconnected it. Okay, so it just detected the disconnect. Alright, kit choice six name uh, just started returning a um, an array of two. Well, the problem there is now all the index have shifted. So the controller two became controller one. And if you're playing a multiplayer game with multiple controllers, basically at this point everybody has to s swap controllers because they're no longer mapped to the right LED number and whatever. So. One way around this would be somehow get the device ID and the joystick names or add another call that we can get the device to map to the controller index. Another way would be if I could somehow reset the index or set the controller number. But without the device ID, I don't really know what the original order is. Another way could be just keep the indexes the same. So just the joystick uh, input, get joystick names. The zero element would just go null. They'd keep their spot in the order list. And if another controller connected, it would uh, it would set its joystick name in the index that it was previously. All right, thanks for watching.